What's going on, Faulkner's Feast? Today, we got seafood. Twitter poll voted breakfast first. Just uploaded that video today. It's probably not going to be the same day I upload this next video, but you understand I'm a busy guy. So, yeah. So, uh, we got tilapia today. It's going to be a Parmesan panko breadcrumb uh, crusted oven baked tilapia. Uh, I didn't really know what kind of seafood to really cook. I've had salmon before. Erin's not the biggest fan of salmon. She asked for flounder. Apparently, flounder's not in season during this time. I'm not that knowledgeable about fish. But, yeah. So, we are going to be cooking tilapia. It has a similar taste to flounder, apparently. Thank you, Google. Um... And we're going to be using some seasonings and breadcrumbs for it. I'm going to be cooking up some jasmine rice because, you know, I fucking love my rice, folks. Shout out Michelle Gagne, a.k.a. Mom, for this kick-ass banana shirt. It was just Mother's Day, and she's still spoiling me. You the bomb. You the real MVP, Mom. Thank you. God bless you. But, yeah, let's get cooking, folks. Let's figure out what we have to do for this recipe. Also, shout out to my wonderful girlfriend for getting me a new tripod so I can easily balance and hold this. Say thank you, Ziggy. Thank your mom. She is supplying for this family in our times of need. Say thank you, Ziggy. Okay, Ziggy's embarrassed. Okay, so clearly we're gonna need tilapia, so I've got two fillets. They look pretty damn thin, so I don't really know what they're supposed to look like, but that's what we have. We've got flour for the breading process. Thank you, Wegmans. Thank you, Danny. We've got some panko breadcrumbs, and we got a block of Parmesan cheese. Buying in blocks if it's hard. Helps it safe for a while. Look, it's still good, no mold or anything. All right. We also have milk. So milk can help the fish. Milk. She needs some milk. milk. Do you need some milk? She needs some milk. She needs some milk. Do, do you need some milk? Excuse me, miss. Do you need some milk? <laughs> oh, you need some milk. Oh, he needs some milk. Don't the people. You know we have to play that vine. Like, oh, the entire video. About it. oh, he needs oh. some yeah, so milk. Milk in case if we have to soak the fish. So apparently if the fish smells fishy, originally these were frozen. So what's gonna happen if these smell fishy, we soak it in milk for 15 to 30 minutes. Are you still laughing about that he needs some milk? Yeah. Okay, well there you go, Aaron's interrupting. But she did get me this nice tripod, so. We all have to find our nuances in life. What does nuance mean? I can't even really use it. What does nuance mean? Please help me, I don't know what it means. But okay, yeah, uh, so let's get cooking. So we had the fish breasts or whatever you want to call it, fillets soaking. I also bought them skinless and boneless, except there might be bones in it according to the packaging. But yeah, so we're gonna have to wait patiently for about 15 minutes. They did smell a tad bit fishy. At first I didn't think they were that bad. Then Aaron smelled them, said they were terrible. Then I smelled them and they actually were pretty fucking bad. So trust your girlfriend's judgment. There you go. That's probably the most knowledgeable thing I've ever saw on Faulkner's piece. Trust your girlfriend's judgment. Period. She needs some milk. Oh, he needs some milk. milk. He needs some milk. So, we're going to start the oven to 425. Nice. 425. And we got a... Uh, nice cooking sheet that looks like crap underneath but we put some aluminum foil for easy cleanup we're gonna spray this when time comes we got some parm chi here that i shredded up i don't think i'm gonna need that okay, so i had to stop that video real quick so we're doing a new one but yeah so we have some parm chi here and we got a plastic bag for the parm chi to go into and then we got some panko breadcrumbs i'm gonna start the rice soon because damn i love my rice we also have a nice bowl of flour here to put it into once the fish is done soaking. So yeah, patience, folks, patience. Oh, it's okay, we're, we're keep, keep it rolling. We gotta get all the seasonings in here. So, for seasonings, I went with black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, Creole seasoning, because I have had this laying around, and paprika. This has 
Where are the ingredients? Uh, salt, red pepper, black pepper, chili powder, dehydrated garlic, silicon dioxide, anti-caking agent. Lit. So there you go. And I've also put the panko breadcrumbs and the Parmesan in. You're gonna have to adjust how much you need. So starting off, we're gonna put a little bit of olive oil into it to help make it a little bit more sticky. A little bit of dash of olive oil. There you go. We're gonna shake it around. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your booty. more olive oil in. You're gonna have to repeat this step. Do little by little, don't completely soak it. Cats are farting in the background. World star! World star! He needs some milk. Are you getting your close up on the mustache? We're gonna do one more, and then I think it should. Uh, how do you think that looks, Chef Aaron? You think that looks decently coated? There you go. So you know what? Two times the charms, folks. So there you go. So I put a little bit of Cajun seasoning in the milk. To fuck. Okay, we're gonna keep rolling. Actually, no, we're no. Hey, this, we're back. So we put a little bit of Cajun seasoning in the milk. We're gonna coat in flour. Get in there. Maybe we should've used a bigger bowl. It's too late, we're already dedicated to it. It's true, dedicated to the cause of providing everybody with easy to do meals, even though I suck at breading. Aaron offered to do it, but I thought I should learn. Back into the milk. What does the recipe say? Back into the milk. Into the bag. I love the smell of rice. Huh? One at a time? Yeah. Okay, Erin wanted to voice her opinion. There's not enough room for two. What do you think you do? I don't think there's enough for two in there. She made a good business call. Okay, so we got the breast in there. We're gonna shake. Wow. Pretty sure I was supposed to have parsley, but fuck it. We don't want veggies. Just kidding. We're going to have mixed veggies as well. How's that look? Can you see? Oh, looks great. Maybe that was your video skills. There you go. On to the... Well, also with the aluminum foil, you're gonna to wanna to spray it with nonstick coating. I'll cover that later. Okay, we're gonna do this for us now. Flour is getting on my floor! I am a hot mess today. You spilled fish milk on the floor, and you're concerned about flour getting on the floor? I disinfected the floor. We're safe. We're safe, folks. And into the bag you go. Now I'm getting fish milk all over this, but whatever. I'm gonna shake this over the sink because why not? This is not looking hot, folks. Okay, <laughs> like my hands, that's what I'm talking about. This fish looks very good. Delicious, folks. We also have rice in the Instant Pot. If you wanna go see the Instant Pot video, please feel free to go watch my uh, Jasmine Rice, my first video when I was not Faulkner's Beast, when I was cooking with Luke Faulkner. Should I put more stuff on it or no? It's recording. Should. So we got a little bit of extra breadcrumbs, so screw it. We're gonna put it on top, because who cares? Let's get, oh, beach. Get connected, oh, three. Dun, 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 dun. Cats are still fighting, rain's fighting. World star. My hands look shitty, but that's okay, folks. That's all there is. Okay, so oven is preheated to 425, so I'm gonna put this in for about 25 minutes, 20 to 25 minutes. I will put how long it took me during this. 
But yeah, here's Rain eating. Hey Rain, time for your close up. You're famous. Say hi to YouTube. She's eating right now. She's uh, she's famous now. She doesn't have time. Damn, girl, she's thick. You're a unit. Yes, you are. You're a unit. A YouTube or a Google or whatever to know how it's ready is when you go like this and you twist it and it flakes. And I think it's flaking, folks. And you can see it all flaky and stuff. So I think it's ready. Who knows? All right, so here you go. We got our finished product and my wallet in the photo. Great. But yep, we got our finished product. We got some mixed veggies. We have some tilapia. Came out very crisp and nice and flaky. And we have white rice underneath it, specifically jasmine rice, because it is the more superior white rice. We got some lemon. So, gotta squeeze it all on. Cheers. Jesus, I just demolished this lemon. It just exploded everywhere. He needs some milk. I don't even think I got that on video, but whatever. Great, now I need a tissue, because <laughs> I just demolished it all over my hand. My hands smell lemon fresh though, so at least you know they're clean. All right, so Erin already said this was pretty good. She got a bite before me. Mm. Pretty damn good. Crunchy, the seasonings went well with it. Ow, I have a cut on my hand. And the lemon got it. <sighs> the spice is definitely there, though. It's a little bit spicy, but not, like, overwhelming. There you go, folks. Aaron said it was good. This is me. Hi. I look like that, like, 50-year-old dad trying to... Oh, that's true. I look like a 50-year-old dad trying to blend in with his kids. Hey, here to party here this weekend. Look at my chairs. I had to tip them over because the wind keeps knocking them over. This is me and my porch. And now a word from our sponsors. Hey, everybody. This is Ziggy. Here to tell you to go check out Adam and Wendy podcast. No, who the hell do you think you are? And I am telling you, to go check out the Adam and Wendy podcast, featured somewhere on this YouTube video. They are very great and very funny and talk about a lot of current issues. Feel free to give them a watch. They really appreciate it. And they like talking about fun stuff. And I'm gonna turn around. Can't escape the camera. Thank you everybody for watching. I hope you all have a great day. Thank you. Help me record. Were you recording that? Surface concern. It's got fish water all over it. Leia. Okay, make sure you crop this out because the floor looks dirty. Just show it up above. Ziggy! Hi, Zig! Hi, Ziggy boy. How you doing, buddy? Aww. He needs some milk! Alright, ready? <laughs>